All right, hey guys. So today I'm going to be taking a look at a game called Oh Sir, the Insult Simulator. You may be wondering what an insult simulator would be like. It's sort of like a one-on-one -on -one duel um, to see who can come up with the best insults, and you take turns just insulting each other round after round, and whoever comes with the best comes up with the best insults uh, basically wins the uh, duel. This is multiplayer and it's also uh, single player as well if you want to play against computers. So I'm just going to play against the CPU to start out with and at the end of this video I'll try to play multiplayer. It is cross-platform as well. I think this is this game is also on mobile platforms. I'm not entirely sure uh, but if it is it's pretty cool. There should be um, tons of games playing so uh, let's go ahead and learn to insult so I can teach you guys how to play or at least you guys can learn how to play. So let's go to the first steps. How do you do, sir? I'm going to teach you how to defend yourself against insults. Every All right. insult needs a subject. Let's start with something straightforward. Hmm. Hmm. Your wife. Now I'll build an insult that I'll use against you. Don't worry, sir. I'm a gentleman. Uh, and I forgot to mention, there's like a list of words in the middle, and you take turns picking like words or phrases that you want to put in your sentence, and uh, whoever comes up with the best one, of course, wins the uh, little round. So here we go. Hmm. So he picked your face. Right. Now, if you dare, tell me what you think of my wife. Your wife is very naughty. <laughs> I think you may be right about that. In return, I'll tell you a thing or two about your face. Your face is dull and ugly. You can carry on if you have a conjunction. A conjunction? Your wife is very naughty and... I'll go easy on you and end my sentence here. Looks like... Some dirty rag. <laughs> now, let's exchange insults, shall we? Your wife is very naughty and looks like some dirty rag. Oh, your face is dull and ugly. Oh, so as you can see, such there's... An exquisite insult! My pride is hurt, sir. Depending on the quality of your insult, it affects the amount of damage that you inflict on the enemy. There's some more strategy involved into the game, like some characters have weaknesses, and you can make combos, and you can, if you insult the same thing multiple rounds, you get a, a additional points for that. So what I'm going to do now, I'm just going to go ahead and um, leave the tutorial, because I don't want to go through the entire tutorial, that would be a very boring video. So instead, I'm just going to go straight into an instant argument, and we're going to play as Sir Knight. We can look at his Sir profile. Knight at your service. So, he can't keep up with the modern times, and let's see. Kids these days, TV, rap music, video games, he has more important matters on his mind than keeping up with the infantile new technology, fashion, and language. Reading Shakespeare, latest book, winding clocks, treating his urinary inco incontinence, but everything changes when he realizes that the kids look jealousy at his old-fashioned clothes. At that moment, he decides to become a hipster. So, I think my weakness is that if they insult my clothes, that's my weakness. So let's go ahead and start a battle. We have to click a scenario. Looks like this one is locked for some reason. I'm not sure why. We'll start out with the pet shop. Why not? Every level has a certain scenario as to why you're fighting. About this parrot I purchased. The Norwegian blue? What's wrong with it? It's dead. That's what's wrong with it. No, no. He's resting. <laughs> He's resting. Mm. All right, so now we're fighting. That guy said the uh, mm. parrot's dead, and I guess he wants a refund, and I'm not giving him a refund. So let's see. I have 10 seconds left. Let's pick one. Um, I'm going to say your sister. He said your husband. I'm going to say your sister is not interesting. <laughs> what? Oh, your husband was defeated by your cousin's car. Is not interesting and your husband was defeated by your cousin's car. What the heck does that mean? Your sister is not interesting and is getting fat. <laughs> well, that's kind of a good one. And we can also drink this tea once per turn to get two additional words. 
Um, unfortunately, I don't have a conjunction. So I'm going to go ahead and just end my turn here. Your sister is not interesting and is getting fat. <laughs> <laughs> your husband was defeated by your cousin's car. That doesn't even make sense. Hmm. Okay, I'm gonna say your face. Hmm. Let's see if I have anything down here. Uh, I guess I'll say is stone dead. Doesn't really make a whole lot of sense. Your face is stone dead. That's not really an insult. Um, and your your beloved auntie was this conversation that doesn't make sense either. Your face is stone dead, and uh, let's go ahead and drink the coffee. And your mother <laughs> and dance is like this. This isn't gonna make any sense at all. Your face is stone dead, and dance is like. Your mother. And I'm gonna put a dot dot dot. I'm gonna make a super long one. When you put the dot dot dot, um, it actually Your lets you... Was this conversation... And I have proof! It doesn't make any sense! Hmm. Alright, so if you use the dot dot dot, you can, um, hmm. continue your insult onto the next turn and make a super long insult. So, your face is stone dead and dances like your mother. And... And your sister. I think we insulted his sister before, so we may get a combo for this. And your sister is very naughty. <laughs> um, we have to use our coffee here. Uh, we don't have anything else. So let's go ahead and end our turn. Hopefully that's a good enough insult. Doesn't make any sense whatsoever, but hopefully we do a lot of damage. Oh man, he has a long insult too. A cheap suit supports your hat and was some bloody menga. Oh, that was a good uh, one. Didn't do much face damage. Your is stone dead and dances like your mother. What? And your sister is very normal. Oh, I got a combo. Your sister times two because I said combo because I uh, said that before. And I did 25 damage. So that was completely worth it. Um, so this time I'm going to say... Your wife hmm. <laughs> must be fun at parties. <laughs> That's a good one. Your wife must be fu fun at parties and... I'm going to say and your father... Alright, he's done with his. Your wife must be f fun at parties, and your father, let's go ahead and drink the coffee, is an old bugger. Oh, I could do this again. I'm going to say and, and then I'm going to do the dot dot dot, and I'm going to make a super long insult next turn. Let's think. A grunting so was born in your house. Ugh. Doesn't make mm. any sense at all. These insults need to be better. <laughs> mm. Your wife must be fun at parties, and your father is an old bugger, and... And your sense of style... Um... Uh... Is not... Migratory? I don't... I don't think that even makes any sense. And your sense of style is not migratory, and everyone knows that. <laughs> so I guess I finished because I used an exclamation your mark at the end. Was the communists? Ooh. What? Your wife must be fun <laughs> at parties, and your father is an old bugger, and your sense of style is not migratory, and everybody knows that. Rude. Oh, mm. got him. So I think his uh, his weakness is style, if I'm reading that correctly. So if I keep saying things about his clothes, he will get mad, or he will uh, suffer more damage. So I'm going to say your son. Oh, I should say your father. Mm. Crap, I should have said your father. 
Dang it. I could have got a combo there. Your son swallowed a chewing gum. Alright. That doesn't make sense. And you can't deny it. <laughs> okay. Okay. Okay, my insult is horrible. Your father and your country don't like this conversation. Okay, that's kind of weird. Your father and your country. Don't I, I should be able to kill him or take him out. Ooh. Ouch! Your son swallowed a chewing gum, and you can't deny it. Yeah, you are clearly out. not a parrot expert. I can assure you, I am qualified to assess his mood. I'm sorry, you were right all along. He's probably just pining for the fjords. The end. So it looks like I won. I can also participate in a tournament, and there's also a bunch of different characters I can choose from. But I think what I'm going to do now is I'm going to go back, and I'm going to play online, insult a human. And, uh, let's see. Let's go ahead, insult on a couch, insult online. I'm going to insult online because I don't have anyone with me, unfortunately. Uh, let's check out the other characters, Mrs. Maggie. You can call me Mrs. Maggie, love. Mr. J. Shufflebottom. Oh, hi there. John Shufflebottom here. <laughs> Style's not something to take lightly. Alright, there's a bunch of other characters apparently you can unlock. I don't know how, but I think I'm going to stick with Sir Knight. I think he's kind of funny. Just an old funny guy. So let's go Sir ahead Knight. and try to uh. find a game. Hopefully we uh, find one pretty soon. Let's do one by the lake, I guess. Assault a stranger. Dialing up to the internet. Like the old AOL thing, dial, like dial up. It should make the noise, that'd be awesome. Like the old AOL, like online noises. Waiting for someone to insult. Okay, so apparently. Dang. Alright, so apparently no one's playing on this level. It might be a little bit too late, or a little bit too early in the morning. Um. Let's try it one more time. Let's uh, go back and we're gonna play. Let's play this again. Sir Arthur Knight. Ugh. Let's go over here and let's play. Let's try to play that on the train compartment. Maybe more people will play on the train the train compartment. I don't know. Dialing up to the internet. Come on. Yeah. Unfortunately, I feel like. It's too early in the morning. Currently, it's 5.30 a.m. I know I, I'm awake at really odd times. But uh, if we can't play against a human, at least you guys can see what it's like. And, of course, the CPUs are going to be exactly like real people. Um, it'll just be more fun playing against friends. And especially if you have someone to play, like, couch co-op with. I might have to bring my friend over and play later on and make a video about it. I think it would be a, <laughs> some good fun. Um, I, I actually can probably do that tomorrow. So I think I'm going to do that tomorrow. But for now, since uh, we have a little bit more time left in this video, I'm going to go ahead and go back and... And I'm going to play against the computer again, because I actually had quite a bit of fun. Let's do another one. And I want to show you that there's different scenarios, so we're just going to play a Sir Knight. Knight. Uh. And let's play by the lake, see what happens in the lake. Good morning! Does this dead body belong to you by chance? Of course not. I just borrowed it to put my teacup on. You murdered this poor man to steal his <laughs> rotting corpse? What? How could I murder him when I was hiding in a shrubbery with my rifle the whole morning? Alright, you might have a perfect alibi, but you can't deny that... Uh-oh. <laughs> <laughs> gotta settle it. Oh, so hmm. I killed this guy to rest my tea on his hand? Is that what happened? Okay, anyways, let's see. Your father. Your father is... Oh, I wanted to pick that one. A Muppet. Okay, your father is... Uh... Is your mother. <laughs> your father is your mother. Oh, and... Is dull and ugly. And you can't deny it. 
Your father is your mother and is dull and Oh, that was a good one. You can't deny it. I should have just said your father is your mother and you can't deny it. That was hilarious. Oh, that was a good one too. It didn't do that much damage though. Let's see. Um your husband. is getting fat. Oh, I should also say he's dull and ugly. And... is dull and ugly. I wonder if I'll get a combo for saying dull and ugly twice. I'm not sure about that. Might just be the subject, I'm not sure. Your husband is getting fat and is dull and ugly. Um, let's go ahead and drink the coffee. Can I drink the coffee? Uh... Let's do dot dot dot. Hmm. I should have said worked with, or you I should have picked another one. To be this conversation. What? That doesn't make any sense. Hmm. Your husband husband is getting fat and is dull and ugly. And I'm gonna insult her sense of style. Never watched Star Wars. I'm gonna pick that one and never watch Star Wars. <laughs> Your husband is getting fat and is dull and ugly and never watch Star Wars. What a horrible insult. Um, <sighs> he cross-eyed inbred muck spell. <laughs> Holy crap, that's a good like ending. I can't wait to listen to this. Changes into your sense of oh, she did a combo. Uh, your husband is getting fat and is dull and ugly and never watched Star Wars, you cross-eyed inbred muckspout. Wow. Man, now that was an insult. <laughs> Holy crap. Oh, I can say your husband again and that'll get a combo. Your husband is a reddish... Fishmonger? Is that what it said? In the bottom it says, a ruddish fishmonger. Monger. I don't even know what a fishmonger is. <laughs> Your husband is a ruddish fishmonger. And... Oh, I'm gonna say stone dead. And is stone dead. And I'm gonna drink my coffee. And... Homeless man socks? is silly. Okay, that's a good that's a good insult. Your husband is a reddish fishmonger and is stone dead and is silly. Okay, let's end it. Your husband is a ruttish fishmonger and is stone dead and is silly. Oh, I got a, a combo. She's afraid of uh, being old and deaf. 40 damage. Victory. What? Uh. I confess, it was me who murdered this man. Yeah. His train ticket, direct connection, first class. First class? Then killing him for the ticket is understandable. Please <laughs> try to restrain from murder in the future. <laughs> this game is awesome. Oh, very enjoyable. Uh, definitely good for a few laughs. I'm pretty sure this game is pretty cheap on the Steam store currently. Let's look. It's a uh, dollar fifty. Um, so yeah, definitely worthwhile to check out. And one of my friends got me this game, so I really appreciate um, him for getting it for me. So thank you if you're watching. Uh, a lot of fun. And I'll definitely have to check out this game again when my friend comes over. And we'll play against each other. And hopefully have a few laughs. And maybe I'll record it for you guys. But other than that, it's just a really silly game. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of fun to listen to the insults. And the insults don't really make a lot of sense most of the time, but when they when they do make sense, it's pretty hilarious. So uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Hopefully you uh, enjoyed this video, and I hope you guys have a great day.